Where do I even start? My name is Evan Fallbaum and I'm a filmmaker from Shreveport. My career over the last 15 years is inseparable from the Robinson Film Center. To most people, it may seem like it's just a place to watch movies, but for me, it's always been tied to making movies. I've had three feature-length narrative films that I made in Shreveport all premiere there. A feature-length documentary I made with the Shreveport Regional Arts Council. Three Louisiana Film Prize runs music video compilation. I even hosted the third and final Movie Sauce Film Festival at the Robinson Film Center uh, the first month it was open, back in May of 2008. I also worked there for three years and made a lot of cool stuff. And even before I worked there, I volunteered making pre-show content for the Friday Night Freakouts. And even after I left, I made pre-show content, including the intro reels, the Swepco ads, the last nine Give for Good campaign videos, and, well, Leslie Banks. Leslie Banks here with another edition of Leslie Banks at the Movies. Charles, the movie about the shark. Sharks won't stop us from showing you guys Jaws at the Robinson Film Center on July 25th. Yep, that played on the big screen. And it honestly means the world to me that they let us make that stuff. I'd wager more hours of stuff I've shot have played on the RFC screens than anybody. Accordingly, here's Kimmerton, whose face has probably been on the RFC screens more than anybody. Yeah, I'm the Swepco guy. This is something I'm reminded of quite often. Um, especially when I go to Target, for whatever reason. Uh, I'll be browsing the aisles, and uh, a woman will come up and kind of start staring at me and, and getting closer and closer. And uh, recently, this happened, and I turned, and she said, I'm so sorry, almost emotional, truly. Um, I'm such a big fan of your Swepco ads. Was that, is that you? And I said, yes. And she goes, oh, I can't believe I'm talking to you. And I was looking around like, is she confused? And she said, I can't wait to call my husband when I get to the parking lot and tell him that I met you. That's what she said. And it's really hard to quantify what an enormous value having a film center in Shreveport has been. Just the simple fact of having a local movie theater willing to put your stuff on the screen, even if it's not very good, um, it's a huge confidence booster for someone with a dream of making movies. Four years ago, I moved to San Antonio, which is roughly seven times bigger than Shreveport. But they don't have a film center here, and it's the thing I miss most about Shreveport. There's a comfort in knowing that whenever I make my next film, there's at least one screen I'll be able to play it on. And it's the one that means the most to me. Thank you, RFC. Here's to the next 15 years. Like, I was walking my dog recently, and this guy, like way up uh, by his door doing yard work, said, hey, and I turned and he said, are you the Swepco guy? And I said, uh-huh. And then we just, that was it. I guess this is what being famous is like. You can't go anywhere. Like I really might have to stop going to Target.